Hey guys, it's Ryan Bridge Bugman. And don't be fooled by the orange. This is not a hunting related thing. Look, everybody who knows me knows I'm pretty passionate about hunting. Um, and I am, because here I'm, I'm out here in bear season right now, Pennsylvania, opening day of Pennsylvania bear season. And I'm out here having a good time waiting on a bear. But here's what happens when passions collide. I'm sitting here on this overlook. It's a, it's a cool spot. And I'm just waiting on a bear. And I glance over here to the left. And there's a huge Cecropia silk moth cocoon. It's the, these are the largest moths in North America. My favorite of the silk moths. And there's a big cocoon hanging right over there in that tree. Um, and just to show you how, how easy it is to find these things. If, if you have a trained eye and you know how to find these things. I wasn't looking for it, but there it is. Um, imagine if I wandered around in here for a full afternoon trying to find cocoons. I'd probably find a boatload of these things. So I'm going to walk you over here real quick um, and just show you what these things look like when they're hanging in a tree. Because this is pretty cool, man. I'm actually in Clearfield County, so I'm all like dead center right in the middle of the state right now. Um, and again, we're doing bug man stuff. I'm breaking all the hunting rules and I'm making noise. But I can't help it. I gotta go get this cocoon because it's it's uh, this is what I do, man. All right, check it. I want to get you turn around here. Okay, we're gonna go get this cocoon now. Get an idea of how I saw it. This cocoon. Is right in there. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go find it. Ah. Uh, it's a trip. All right, let's go get this cocoon. It's a, it's a big cocoon too, which is really cool. Cause that means if it's alive, if it's viable, this is going to be a big moth. Check that out. That is a Cecropia cocoon. Now it looks like it might be hatched, which I'm okay with. If it hatched, that's not a, that's not a terrible thing. That's not a terrible thing. It feels like it might be hatched. Okay, we're looking at it now. And it is hatched. This is emerged. So a big old Cecropia moth came out of this cocoon. And right there's where it came out of. So I'm a little less excited now that I know it's not an actual moth in there. But that gives you an idea of how easy it is to find these things if you have a trained eye. The Cecropia silk moth cocoons. Very cool. Right here in Clearfield, PA. Not a bad thing. Not a bad way to spend a day in the woods, hunting, finding bugs. Very cool stuff.